Hey, what's going on guys? Snowball back here once again, and uh, just a little friendly Russian sniper here, just uh, going at, uh, rush, rushing, sniping, uh, sorry, I don't know, suddenly Russian sniper, like, hello, I am uh, here today to uh, snipe, no, it's nothing like that, but, uh, yeah, just playing some TDM, normally I play uh, Search and Destroy, as you guys should, or probably already know, but, uh, every now and then I just like to play some TDM, uh, especially if I'm solo, sometimes uh, Search gets a little hard. Uh, when, when you're playing the public matches and everything, uh, Search and Destroy is probably the most competitive one out there. Uh, TDM is pretty much just uh, something to go and fool around in if you you know, you want to try out something new or you just want to relax and sit back and have a little bit of fun. You know, not just try your panties off and everything like that. Uh, so sometimes I go to TDM just to kind of relax and have a little bit of fun. It may not look like I'm relaxing too much here because I'm actually getting a lot of kills, but... Uh, I wouldn't even play with the headset or anything. It's nice to take the headset off sometimes. Uh, you know, just kind of rushing around. I was watching a live stream and uh, it had a little bit of music going on to it. So, you know, I just pretty much wasn't really paying attention to the game very very much. Uh, besides just, you know, looking at it, I guess. I wasn't trying to sound horror or predict where anybody was at or anything like that. But uh, if you guys haven't checked out the uh, Twitch lately, guys, you definitely need to check it out. It's getting uh, a lot of fun. They finally cleaned out the people on the lobby leaderboards who were hacked and all that. That was really annoying. Watch this guy out get him. It was pretty funny. It was getting pretty annoying. So I've been trying to grind out S&D on the uh, leaderboards for a while now. I started at about rank 30,000. And uh, currently, well, when I got off yesterday, I was rank... Uh, what was it 77 and uh you know started scanning through the leaderboards noticing a bunch of people are hacked and everything like that and it's really easy to tell who's hacked because they have less kills than you they have less plants diffuses everything you know there was like the number two guy on the leaderboards with like two plants and like three kills it's like all right sure i just hit twenty thousand kills today it's pretty funny how you know they're above you but they get into hacked lobbies and that's what happens and they, you don't get into a hacked lobby by accident. I mean, it's somebody you know, they put you in the lobby, and you start getting score, and you don't back out because it's boosting you up in the leaderboards a lot. It's pretty stupid. But, uh, so anyways, it's a bunch of people above me like that, and it's really frustrating, and I was like, you know, it would be pretty cool to get to, like, rank 1. That'd be awesome, you know? But, uh, rank 1 had, like, 17 million score, and I only had 1 million. And I started playing Search and Destroy in January, and so from January until now, today, I've been grinding it out to get from rank 30,000 all the way until uh, 53 I got to today. Because they finally wiped out the rest of the people on the leaderboard, so it shot me from 77 to 57, or 56 it was. And uh, I played I played a few games tonight and got up to 53. And now I got freaking 20,000 more score to go to uh, get to the next level. It's, it's crazy. And you know... Normal game of S and D for me will probably be like a 600 score somewhere around there, 500, 600 score on a good game. So yeah, that gives you a picture of how long it would really take to get 20,000 just to rank up once. Look at this guy, what are you doing? Uh, but yeah, so if you guys haven't checked out the live stream, we're playing a lot of S and D and ranking up, getting some really good games, and uh, trying to get as many wins as we can with uh, the least amount of losses that we can. Got my entire win loss up there, and then I got a uh, daily win loss also. I thought it was pretty cool. It was suggested to me. A couple people suggested it, wanted to see it, and liked the idea, so I threw it in there and started doing it, so everybody can see uh, how many games uh, during the day, you know, in one day that I win and lose. And you know, sometimes it's like. Uh, 10 games and 8 losses or something like that and those are the frustrating days but uh normally you know on a good day whenever we play for a while it gets to like 20 wins and like 2 losses or something like that and it's uh it's really fun so uh you know just really enjoying the game in general really enjoying ghosts it's uh jesus probably one of my favorite call of duties right now look at this guy look at this guy that was awesome i loved when i turned around and just shot him but uh yeah you know i don't play only search uh we go into tdm sometimes and a couple different game types but it's just search is where it's at right now. Search and destroy is so fun. I, I just don't know why. I just got addicted to it. And uh, just play it all day, every day. And uh, just glad they took out all the people on the leaderboards. Look at this uh, last few kills here. Uh, <laughs> this guy's spinning in circles. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching. I've been Snowball. You guys have been awesome. And uh, I'm going to leave you guys with these last couple of kills there. And yep, game's over. Hopefully you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in my next video. And hopefully in the live stream. Stop by and say hi. Alright, adios.